So hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I decided um, to do a get ready with me video because I, right now I'm going to go out right now. So I was like, why not pop out the camera and film, you know? So um, this is my look for today. Um, if you want to see more of this look, keep on watching. Bye. So I'm going to put the Visible Lift um, Radiance Booster by L'Oreal. I love this and it smells so good. It looks like it's pink. And it gives you like a little shine to your face. That's what I like about it. So I haven't done one of these videos in forever. Um, so yeah, so hopefully I do it right. <laughs> so today we were going to go to the gym. Well, we went to the gym. Um, it was closed because... There was no water on um, the toilets weren't working yesterday when i went to the gym the toilets weren't working but they were open um so i guess they decided to close today but of course we didn't know we woke up me and my husband and the kids we went and it was closed i was like oh my goodness like darn it like i already missed two days out of this week because when the gym was closed because there was ice on the road so they closed that down and then and then this it's like oh my goodness so i'm gonna put the l'oreal age perfect um, facial oil i use this so my face doesn't have to feel dry because sometimes like it can get super dry and i think this helps me because i get dry around this area a lot so it keeps my skin very moist throughout the day so yeah, so it was closed and I was like, oh my goodness Today was biceps and triceps for me So I didn't of course i'm gonna have to do that tomorrow So that means I have to go saturday and sunday because I missed, missed two days because it was closed not my fault It was just closed <laughs> But yeah, so i'm gonna go in with l'oreal um inflammable uh, 24 hour pro mat I got this in 106 Sun Beige. I love this foundation. I It feels so nice on my face. It really covered up my blemishes. Because I do have like little red spots, you know. And it does cover it. And then I'm just going to go with my beauty blender that I bought at Walmart. I forgot the brand. Um, I forgot the brand name, but... I love this sponge. I know, it's dirty. Um, it's flat here, so I like it because, I don't know, I feel like it actually goes inside my skin than being it round, you know? And then this is for, like, the concealer or whatever. So I love this blender. And I gave it, um, for Christmas, I gave all my sisters one of these because I just love it. I was like, I have to share. I have to share. And I'm already running out of this. And I just need to be careful because I already have um, um, my eyebrows done. So, I just need to be careful with that. <laughs> I forgot the brand name. Oh, my goodness. I forgot. Um, I know you can buy it at Walmart. It's by these two girls, these two ladies. Oh, my goodness. I'm trying to remember the name of it. Um, what's her name? Oh my god, what's her name? So my internet's not working, so it's down. Because oh, everybody's home. That's why, so everybody's using the internet. And there was no school today. Again, it's been three days that my daughter hasn't gone to school. And it's like, oh my goodness, yes. Well, she was supposed to go to school today. But I guess... The school decided not to open. Uh, you know, their excuse was, you know, there's still ice on the roads, but there's nothing. I went, I went to the school, like, perfectly fine or whatever, you know. But I guess, I guess they were like, it's already Friday, so there's no point of go them going to school. So they just made that excuse, that's what I think. But I was so ready for her to go to school today. Okay. It's just been too long. She needs to go back to school. <laughs> oh, 
Lord. So she's going to go back Monday. Um, so, yes. Yes, I'm that type of mother that, like, want their kids to go to school because I need to, like, relax. <laughs> you know, because it can get very crazy around here. Super duper crazy. So now I'm going to go in with NARS Concealer. So I'm just getting ready um, to go because my husband's going to buy work clothes. So that's what I'm getting ready for. To go help him. <laughs> oh, the beauty blender is by Real Techniques at Walmart and I just love it. I just love it. The sponge is, I think it's better than the beauty blender in Sephora. That's like freaking what, $25? This was like $5.93 or something, you know? And it's so good. It's not hard. It is not soft. Um, it's just really in between, you know? So, I Because I really wanted to look for a beauty blender that I like, like a sponge, you know? Because I didn't really want to spend $25 again, you know, on a sponge. So, I was like, I was trying different ones. I tried the e.l.f. Um, didn't really like that one. It was too, too hard, you know. Um, and then this one, I picked this up at Walmart too. I don't know what the brand is. But I do not like it. And I was like, you know, let me just try this. So, I tried it and I fell in love with it. I just love it, okay? So now I'm just going to go in with the Laura Mercier um, loose powder. I use this sponge for the powder. And I just put it under my eyes. I'm not going to bake. I just like to like soak it into my skin. Um, I think it's a better outcome with that than just like baking it. Because I feel when I bake it, like I can feel like it's dry under my eyes. So I press it in and I like it better like that. And then I'm just going to go in with L'Oreal True Match Powder. I put this all over my face except this area here that I put the loose powder on. And I'm just going to go like that. I'm going to put it under my neck. I stopped putting foundation on my neck. Um, so I just put the foundation like here in this area under here. And then I put powder. And I actually like it like that better. Like it blends in very well. So that's what I do. And I'm wearing white. Oh, Lord. <laughs> and there you go. And then I'm just going to go in with Hula um, by Benefit Bronzer. So my sister gave me these brushes um, for Christmas, and they're so good. I just love it. I just love these brushes. So I'm just going to line it, and then I'm going to use a different brush. I just love it. It feels so smooth. It does not feel cheap or anything like that. I just love this brush. And then now I'm going to go in by Real Techniques. And then just like blend it in. Yes. You got popcorn? Okay. My kiddos are saying that they got more popcorn, which I said right now I'll put you popcorn, but you know what? They don't listen. They don't listen. <laughs> okay, there you go. All set. And then now I'm going to go in with e.l.f. Um, blush palette. I'm going to use this orange one here and also uh, this other brush. This is actually like a powder brush, but to me it was too, too small, you know? Like, this is my powder brush. You see the difference? Like, it's 
this is a lot poofier you can say and bigger and this is just like smaller so i was like you know what let me just use this as a freaking blush brush you know so yeah And I just love this color. I used to wear pink, like, ooh, so long ago. Pink, hot pink. And I was like, I changed. <laughs> I want more like a natural look, you know. But sometimes, you know, I do want to wear um, pink blush. But most of the time, I use this one. I don't really use these three colors. But I love this um, So I'm going to go in with the Jaclyn Hill palette. This is my favorite palette. Like, I have other palettes, but this is my go-to palette all the time. I just, it has every color in here. Um, but when I travel, I cannot take this with me. I have to take a smaller one. But you know what? I think that she should make a small palette, like a travel palette, just with, like, nude colors. I think that would be so awesome because, girl, let me tell you, I would take that everywhere with me. Shoot, I will. Okay, so I'm going to go in with, I forgot, is it Pukey? I think this is Pukey. This is one of my favorite colors of all times in this palette. I use it all the time. So I'm just going to put it in my crease. And of course, be careful because I do have uh, my eyelashes on already. Well, my real eyelashes, but you know, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I already put mascara on them, so I have to be very careful. So now I'm going to go in with Mocha. I'm just going to put that in the crease. And I'm just going to put that all over my eyes. I really want like a brown today. But it looks so nice. All that brown. Beautiful. I need to hurry up because this video is going to be long. I'm just going to put that here. My eyelid. So those two colors that I use on my eyes, I put them underneath. Um, and then in the crease, I put beam. And on the eyebrow bone, too, I put beam also. So I just really want this video quickly. Not too long. Hopefully it's not long. You know. Um, but I'm just going to go over my eyelashes with um, the Falsies Push-Up Angel by Maybelline. And I'm just going to use the brush because when I went, they were out. They didn't have waterproof. So, this is the brush for the Falsies Push Up um, Angel. This is the brush. This is the brush. Um, it's not my. It's not my favorite. Um, but it is good to like separate the eyelashes, and then I just swap it. I know it might not be like. Might be gross to you guys, but you know what? I gotta do what I gotta do. I love, I love this brush. This, I just love it. I just love it. So for lips, I use um, the Mil Milani um, Plum Rose and then NYX Butter Gloss. And I can't even pronounce this. I don't know if you can see it. I can't pronounce that word forget it i'm not even gonna try so yeah um oh one thing i'm gonna use the mario um spray for my face which i need to buy some more i love this because it does not make my face dry whatsoever um i tried other sprays and it's just so dry just don't like it so i love this which i need to go pick one up soon so yeah, guys, this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I might have been talking too much, which it's okay. Um, I think I'm just a little bit nervous because I haven't done a video, a makeup video in forever. So yeah, so if you like this video, guys, give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. Um, so yeah, have a good day, guys.